So I've got a question as well, which is, what is the difference between spinal flow and chiropractic? And that's a pretty cool question too, because my background is as a chiropractor. You know, I love the chiropractic profession. And what the chiropractic profession really believe and what their philosophy is, is that we have a brain and a nervous system, which is a master controller. And as long as that's functioning well, without interference, without subluxations, the body is healthy. When there are blockages anywhere on that spinal column, those blockages called subluxations are the cause of disease, illness in the body. And what chiropractors do is they come to locate the blockages, they go to correct them so the body's able to come back into function as the body can heal. Chiropractors believe that the body has inside itself an innate intelligence. The innate intelligence is what heals the body. With the spinal flow technique, we have pretty similar beliefs. We believe as well that there's an intelligence inside every single person's body. That intelligence, that life force flows via a spinal wave. That spinal wave moves up and down the body and that's where that life force travels through the system. In spinal flow technique, we also know that there are blockages in the body too. So the blockages in the body, the physical, the chemical and emotional blockages that store inside the body, what they do is they create stress, disease and illness in the system. The difference that we do with the spinal flow technique is we really help our clients find those blockages themselves. We know that their body has ability to heal itself and what we do is we allow their body to connect to where their blockages are and what we feel is under our hands we can feel those blockages being released. So with the spinal flow technique your clients are able to find, locate and release their own spinal blockages by themselves which is pretty cool.